Everybody has a story, but not everybody knows how to tell it. You were handsome. Good thing that you saved all your pictures. My first film in Rome was Ben-Hur. I was in charge of the actors getting them on and off the set on time. So I saved Ben-Hur. <laughs> I love the past, you see. They say when you drown, all your life goes before you. And here I am unwrapping things from my life. And I feel I'm drowning. I've survived so many people, I can't believe it. Sandra D. I never remember Sandra smiling. One day when they said it's a wrap, I ran to the front gate. And all of a sudden there was a burp, burp, and it was Rock Hudson. A rock said, we're going to go down to Capri. Why don't you come along? I don't have any luggage or anything. He says, we'll buy whatever we need. When you are 80 years old, will you ever get an invitation inviting you for four days on the Isle of Capri? I looked at him, and I went. I never made any lasting attachments. Show business suited me fine. You knew everybody for the run of the show. After that, goodbye. Christmas cards once a year. That's about it. I never thought of myself being remembered. We have a star here. She won't be thought about. If you film her, you become immortal. I would love to have been a song and dance man. The untold story of a nobody. And you wonder, why was it not told? <laughs>